security agency, but to limit its power to spy on Americans. Two News' Rod Decker with more for us now. Rod, this was a victory for Senator Mike Lee, wasn't it? Big win. For several years, he pushed this bill, and, and nobody paid much attention. Then the NSA authority ran out. Everyone, everyone uh, was fixed on how to get it back. The, the White House uh, supported Lee, and so did Democrats and Republicans. We turned them back because they didn't give us a proper warrant. When the feds demanded data from Utah's X mission, they were turned down. But the big providers all handed over all their data on Americans' phone calls to the National Security Agency, which stored some of it here in this new Utah data center. This bill represents a good compromise. Utah Senator Mike Lee long championed a bill to limit NSA data gathering only to what the agency could show might be relevant to fighting terror. Today, after delays that shut down the NSA, Congress finally voted for Lee's bill as a compromise to keep gathering anti-terror data, but only after imposing some new restrictions. And it surely undermines American security by taking one more tool from our warfighters. Republican leader Mitch McConnell complained the bill hurts national security. Ex-missions Pete Ashdown says it isn't restrictive enough. we got a long ways to go before the government is back in check with the people. So a lot of people don't like this bill. It isn't their first choice, but they said after... They stayed up late at night and they fought and they argued. This is probably the best we can do, and they came around to Lee's point of view. Back to